Hi guys, this is the look that I'll be doing for y'all today. It's this blue smoky eye and it's great for brown eyes because it really makes them look lighter and pretty. Of course, if you have um, any other colored eye like blue or green, it would still look beautiful. The first product is this CoverGirl Intense Shadow Blast and I actually have it in the color 825 and it's just a blue color. What I like about this product is that I don't just use it as a base, it's also a primer. So um, it's perfect, you don't have to apply primer and then just this as a base, it's just two in one. I pat some of this um, on first and make sure it's all blended in well and then I apply just a bit more. Um, I've only done it with two coats of this, I'm not sure if you can build up more of the color. Um, but yeah, with the second coat you can actually see some more of the blue and it's not just um, just a light tint of blue. The pigmentation on this isn't awesome. Um, so you can just apply this and, and just not wear an eyeshadow over it, but for, as a base, it's, it's amazing. The first eyeshadow that we're going to be using is from my Manly palette and is this blue color. And I'm actually using it with this eyeshadow brush um, from my Sonia Kashuk um, brush set that I showed in my haul. And I am loving this brush so far. It just picks up the product and there's like no fallout. Which is rare because when you build up the color and you're applying so much of that eyeshadow, it tends to fall out easily. And I literally had zero fallout. It's amazing. I'm going to be placing the eyeshadow all over my eyelid. And I'm just patting it on and building up the color to the perfect blue that I want. If you don't want it to be so vibrant or so crazy, um just apply a little less but I'm just building up the color and I'm just using this blending brush just to blend out all the harsh edges it has no product at all I just didn't want the blue to be noticeable where it ends and where the other eyeshadow starts Now I'm using this Soho brush that I showed in my haul as well and I'm taking teas from the Naked 2 palette and I'm just putting it on my crease and just blending it out. Um, the key to this look is literally blending. You just blend after every eyeshadow. And I'm so sorry that I kind of go out of the frame. I, I'm not used to filming by myself as you can tell. Now with this Sony Kashuk brush also from the brush set, I'm applying Blackout from the Naked 2 palette. And you don't want to bring it um, out as far as you did tease. Um, you want tease to pe peek out just a little bit. And now I'm just blending it with the same blending brush that has no additional product. Just so the black won't be harsh. I'm using this small Eco Toes brush and I'm just applying more of the black out. The key to this is blending because you don't want it to be uh, very harsh, so you'll see me blending a lot. Now I'm using my highlight color and it's actually Foxy from the Naked 2 palette. Here I am using, this is actually an eyeliner brush from the Sonia Kashuk um, brush set. And I'm applying some of that blue that I applied um, to the lid. And I'm applying it from the inner corner to the outer corner just because I wanted to um, I want the blue to peek out from the black when we apply it later in the outer corner um, so you just want to apply it and kind of blend it in you don't want you know a harsh blue line you kind of just want to blend it out a bit and all that they need and money wasn't heard of and there was no greed the people and here I'm using that same equal tools brush that I used to apply it earlier and I'm just taking the same black and just blending it out and as you can see you can see just a bit of blue coming out from the black is not too noticeable or too crazy the next eyeshadow is actually right next to the one that we used first and it's just a slightly lighter blue color I'm just applying it on my lower lash line um, where I applied the other blue 
And now I'm applying it on my la on my lashes, on my eyelid. And I just I just wanted to apply this color because it gives me my own blue color. Even though we applied so many shades of the other blue, it just changes the color just a bit, and it gives me the perfect blue that I wanted. I'm using this e.l.f. liquid liner and I'm just applying just a thin line. I don't want it to be thick or anything. Um, I'm also not winging it out at all. And I am putting black eyeliner on my waterline and I'm connecting it on the inner corner as well as the outer corner. And that is the look. If you guys do recreate it, please leave it as a reader risk video response i don't know why i couldn't say that or send it to me through instagram or twitter thank you so much for watching and live your life beautiful bye you know that i don't walk online